How's it going, everybody? Welcome to a brand new episode of Crypto Clout. I am your host, Phase Crypto. The topic of discussion in this video will, of course, be Electronium. I think that this will be an interesting video to end the year off. Uh, looking forward to a interesting 2020. Uh, I think that 2020 will uh, present a very interesting year um, for Bitcoin and uh, the cryptocurrency world at large. We will be dedicating a uh, substantial portion portion of the end of this video as sort of uh, predictions and uh, look forward to head. Um, but in the meantime, um, you know, Brazilians made 30K worth of Electronium mobile uh, top ups in November. Uh, so nothing less than $30,000 worth of Electronium was used for mobile top ups in Brazil. Um, and of course, uh, Electronium CEO Richard Ells uh, made this known while highlighting the progress of the project in a report. The CEO said in November that in Brazil alone, around uh, US 30K uh, of Electronium top ups were reportedly made. Uh, News uh, Logical reported how Electronium website became the most visited website in Brazil ahead of other cryptocurrency projects. So uh, this is very interesting. I think that it does sort of paint a picture of uh, the real potential and the value uh, of banking the unbanked. Uh, and of course, Electronium being one of those cryptos that has a significant role to play uh, as they've essentially targeted that as their demographic to basically move into parts of the world, uh, which uh, people now have more access to the internet than ever before in a lot of these different neglected areas of the globe, um, which of course will be playing a very interesting role uh, as we see a lot of these different developments uh, taking for um, you know digital payments for everyone. And as more of the world continues to go online, um, you know, and of course with the wide availability of smartphones, uh, it's going to be very interesting to see how um, not only Electronium, uh, but of course with Bitcoin sort of leading the path, uh, you know, charging ahead, uh, it'll be very interesting to see, uh, you know, of course, uh, I think that this decade will be, uh, you know, I'm very uh, much looking forward to, uh, you know, 10 years from now when people look back at uh, the archives of all the videos uh, that I put on this channel, uh, in particular this one, when people will be remembering back... Uh, when Know, probably not very fondly uh, that they missed out on the seven thousand dollar Bitcoin, that they missed out on the three thousand dollar Bitcoin, and all the like. Um, you know, making daily cryptocurrency content on this channel, we pretty much uh, re really well solidified a perspective that I think is going to ring true uh, through the ages uh, you know, to come. When people, uh, you know, the concept of a scarce digital asset uh, is one that people aren't necessarily adjusting to yet, um, but I think that it will be a rude awakening. Um, you know, what with uh, you know Bitcoin where it currently is, I think that we will see a drop off. I mean, I could even expect to see fifty percent. Um, you know, before we actually. So I mean, the time um, to own a Bitcoin. Um, you know, I don't think that the uh, days are very much as limited as some of the more optimistic uh, content creators out there. Um, you know, the bull boys who say that we'll be seeing you know hundred thousand dollar Bitcoin right around the corner. Um, not necessarily that optimistic about it. Uh, I'm even expecting Bitcoin to be maintaining itself at the $7,000 level um, as long as it has. Um, but with all that being said, um, you know, make no mistake, I do look forward to seeing cryptocurrency um, making a huge uh, impact on the you know global uh, you know situation. Of course, and Electronium really does have potential for a bull run. Um, with of course, uh, you know, it's been by nature uh, the fact that it does make the simple technology which is already in place, you know, as time goes forward, um, you know, the law of physics tells us uh, as, you know, more time passes, uh, technology like smartphones becomes cheaper, uh, becomes more accessible and it becomes more available. Um, and of course, uh, this example with what we've seen happening, uh, you know, Brazil, uh, definitely an interesting uh, forward, you know, look into the future of what we can expect to see. Uh, you know, of course, uh, I don't really uh, I want to sign up for this website, but Electronium uh, is feeling charitable. Uh, this was also interesting. Electronium, um, you know, of course, uh, 
you know, kind of interesting little promotion here. I mean, Christmas is already behind us, so I'm not really going to talk about that. But a lot of you wanted me to, um, you know, give that sort of a, a few seconds of my time. Um, you know, it was interesting at the time. I didn't actually get a chance to make a video on that because I've been traveling, um, you know, more on that later. But, uh, you know, hunting the uh, millions of, um, you know, collapsed uh, cryptocurrency uh that's also another interesting article, but I'm not going to click on it because, of course, BBC News uh, wants you to become a member of the website, uh, which I'm not going to do. Uh, so XRP, to remain a cautionary crypto investment in 2020, here's why uh, Ripple uh, blockchain's native token XRP uh, registered one of its most uh, well, worst performances in 2019, and it's likely to extend its losses into 2020, uh, XRP dollar exchange rate. So, I mean, XRP is kind of trash. I mean, Sorry for everybody out there who's a fanboy. Um, I'm not going to um, shit on XRP, though, because I am sort of a XRP fan. Um, you know, as much as you Bitcoin fanatics uh, like to give me shit for it. Uh, I mean, I, I'll, I'll, I'll hold on to my XRP. I mean, what what's the problem? I mean, if you've gotten it cheap enough, then, I mean, you know, if you if it's sort of like anything else in the crypto space. You know, you never really want to bet more than you're willing to lose. Uh, but of course, always, I think that this is a good time for me to um, provide you guys with the reminder. Remember, these videos are for entertainment, educational purposes only. Now, of course, I'm not your financial advisor. I'm not, um, you know, giving any sort of advice here. I'm not your dad. I'm just merely giving you guys my humble opinion. Um, and, uh, you know, of course, uh, this tweet right here, I bought Electronium coin and kept it in my wallet over two years ago. Uh, after a while, I didn't log in and check for about uh, four months ago. I logged in and check for it, but I couldn't see anything. What could I do to my wallet? And then Electronium uh, retweet. Totally. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. I mean, the, yeah. Um, so, I mean, uh, it'll be interesting to see. I mean, if this problem happened with any of you, um, definitely make sure that you uh, contact us or, you know, contact somebody, you know, in particular Electronium um, for advice. Um, you know, I know that this was an issue that uh, people were facing. Um, now, you got to secure your digital assets and nobody's going to do it for you. Um, but yeah, I mean, it will be an interesting year, nonetheless, to see what happens uh, with the cryptocurrency space, you know, the evolution of the internet uh, upon us, um, you know, in part due um, in a large respect to what we can expect to see with blockchain, uh, not only from a business perspective, but also from, um, you know, uh, uh, you know, just the everyday functionality uh, aspect and what with 5G, the Internet of Things, uh, all these very interesting um, things that will be coming up in the next decade. Uh, so, I mean, it is interesting. I mean, and of course... Uh, about it, what happened in twenty in the two thousand tens? We saw Uber, we saw the rise of uh, you know digital payments, Skype, uh, all these different things uh, that were never really um, considerable um, you know before, and now uh, they're parts of our everyday lives. So uh, you know now it'll be interesting to see uh, you know so uh, we've yet to begin the year, and already analysts and uh, industry experts are going crazy with the price predictions for the world's leading digital currency. Allegedly, this is the year when Bitcoin will strike the six-figure range um, with individuals uh, like venture capitalist Tim Draper, uh, Ethereum co-founder Charles Hodgkinson, and even convicted drug seller uh, Ross uh, claiming that Bitcoin will strike a uh, minimum price of 100K by uh, by the time we're ready to say goodbye to 2020. The largest uh, prediction comes from Draper, um, who has moved his, uh, 100, his 250K in Bitcoin price uh, suggestion from 23 forward. Um, you know, so I uh, will be interested. If some of these predictions uh, have to eat their words, um, personally, I don't think that the 100K, uh, I think in a long enough time frame, sure, most definitely, 100K Bitcoin is nowhere near, um, you know, outlandish, uh, but I would say it's going to take a little bit longer than that, um, you know, especially, it's, you know, it all does hinge upon what we see happening, um, you know, with the election that's going to come up um, in 2020 uh, and a lot of other uh, events that will have a lot to impact on, um, you know, the global 
global stage and all these other things. But anyways, the next time you guys hear from me, it will be a new decade. Um, it has been very great uh, spending uh, all this time, you know, with this great community on here. Um, you know, hopefully you guys have uh, learned a lot. I know I have. Um, you know, it's been a great community. Uh, so, and of course, no matter where you are in the world, make sure that you guys comment down below, letting me know, um, you know, what country you're in. Um, you know, last time we had some people from uh, China, um, you know, Australia, Canada is a big one. I, I've learned that my content's big in there. So uh, let me know. Uh, always interesting to read your comments, uh, whatever they might be, questions, comments, concerns, and the like. So all that being said, hope you guys have enjoyed this content. See you guys next video. Have a good one.